Hello everyone. This is February the 5th, 2024. It's, it's Tuesday, 12 noon, and we have a current temperature of 1 degree Celsius. So this snow is almost rain, but if it don't get too heavy, I'm not going to worry about getting my umbrella out, but I might have to if it gets too, if it picks up too much. Now, anyway, I'm on Quinn Pool Road, beginning my video on Quinn Pool, and um, as usual, we'll see where we end up. <laughs> I don't plan it, I just start walking and see where I go. All right. Here we go, down Quinn Pool Road, with a light flurry. And a pretty good day for for uh, February. I don't think that little bit of flurries will hurt my phone. Hmm. It's pretty much the same everywhere you go. There's lots of snow. But I never did a, a snow walking video down the uh, Quinn Pool. So I thought, well, I'm already in the neighborhood. I might as well make a video down here. Right? Yeah, might as well. Since we're already here. Well, oh, I guess we gotta wait for the red light. We're just standing right here while we're waiting for the light to change. Three, two, one, zero. It should be changing anytime soon. Yellow light. We're all ready to go here. Somebody's running through the red light. Okay, let's go. It's pretty much the same thing everywhere on the sidewalk. Sometimes it's all cleared up good, and then there's times that there's a pile of snow on the sidewalk. That's, yeah, it kind of goes like that. This is a real pile of snow. It looks like somebody plowed it. Whoever plowed this out decided to plow a bunch right there. <laughs> Not a great idea, but what can you do, right? Yeah, this is kind of rough walking right here, but I'm hoping it gets a little better. The other side of the tree looks, uh, oh, well, just down here is better. It's just that there's no stores right here, and the store owner is pretty much responsible for cleaning their own, uh, in front of their store. So it's, no stores, it don't get clean. I remember when that building was going up, it wasn't that long ago. Now it's all done. And I better watch where I'm walking. And my phone, as usual, is don't like the cold. Well, there we go. Bring it back around there.
Yeah, that's a good right here. They did a good job on their sidewalk. And it looks like the snow might be stopping, which is good. They don't have to worry about get my phone wet. I got an umbrella with me, but I didn't want to take it out unless I really need it. So if it stops snowing, that'll even be better. Well, they say we got six more weeks of winter. Well, that's not a lot. Six weeks, we'll, be get, we'll get through that pretty fast. It'll only take us six weeks. <laughs> okay. Pond top, I like going in those and browsing, but not today, I guess. I do like looking at stuff in there though, especially the music stuff. Pawn shop's always got a good supplier of guitars and amplifiers and that kind of stuff, which I love looking at. I already own two amplifiers, I guess I don't need any more. I got one amplifier I've had for, let's see, about 20 years. Yeah, it's about 20 years old. It works like the day I bought it. Never had any issues with it at all. Oh, that's too wet right there. I don't want to step in that. So you don't want to get my feet wet. Try another path here. There we go. Not too bad. Yay. Nice. And this looks wet, but I might be able to get through it. I don't want to get my feet all soaked because I've only got my sneakers on. And I don't want to get them wet. Because I'll be walking with wet feet the rest of the day. And that wouldn't be any fun. So I'll try to keep my sneakers dry, if at all possible. See, the snow is melting now, that's what it is. In some places there's puddles. Okay. I might regret not wearing my boots. I did pretty good so far today. I walked through a lot of snow and stuff. My boots were dry. But that water, hmm. Well, we'll have to, we'll have to endure it until I get home, right? Yeah. So we're gonna make this video today. And then I might take a I might take a day off tomorrow. I'm with it. My phone is floating all over the place here. It's the cold weather, that's what it is. Not much I can do about it. Except try to straighten it up when it does that. Just try to straighten it up when it does that, that's all I can do. Like that mural over there? That's nice, eh? I think I got my feet wet in that last spot because I'd feel it by now if they were wet. And I don't feel anything, so I guess they're, I guess they're all right. These are my winter winter sneakers. They'll stand a bit. They'll stand more than a regular 
here you'd wear in the summer, but... When there's really a lot of snow to walk in, I put my winter, winter boots on. But it's harder to walk in winter boots than it is summer things. So. again here but ah, it's not too bad. I'm almost down to Roby deciding what I want to do when I get down here. Not sure. Not I'm not sure. I'm going to see. Oh I got a walk sign I need to find out. I know they all want to make a right turn. <laughs> oh, look at this. This is wet. This is really wet. Mm, I'm going to go this way. This way, I don't know. I can't wade through snow either. Mm. I don't want to step in the water because I'll get my feet wet. But what am I going to do? I got a dilemma here. I might have to walk her out in the street and get past those puddles. That's what I'm going to do when I walk her out in the street. as I can. All right, let's take the other side. Yeah, we're going the other side of the street. It's too wet over here. We'll go on this side. Not so bad over here. All right. Oh yeah, much better. Much better on this side. See that building's coming along pretty good there. You still going up? Well, we'll see when we get down to Roby what we're going to do. Wow, they got the bottom half of that, all the windows all in and everything. Yeah, that's, that's moving right along. I just love seeing new buildings built. Love it. Pizza. Right there. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Getting down the road over here now. I gotta decide what I want to do. Oh, lots of the so we feel to do I want to walk down the street. Something tells me it might be windy out there in the open field. Where if I walk down here, it'll be uh, shielded a little bit. Now I think I'll walk this way. Since I don't want to 
subject you to wind blowing in the phone. We'll try to stay clear of it as much as possible. By the way, that was the Atlantic Hotel with money there. Hope you're enjoying our walk today. We started up on Quinpool and walking across Roby now. I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to go to Spring Garden Road and begin my walk at Roby and Spring Garden. And I'll end it down there somewhere. Down, not there, but down downtown. I'll end it downtown someplace, okay? That'd be alright. I can't remember the last time I walked over to Roby or over to Spring Garden on Roby. It's been a while. There's all the times that I've done Quimpro, I came around the Atlantica Hotel and I waited at the bus stop and caught the bus back to Scotia Square. So this will be a little different today. We're going to walk it. I need to get some kilometers on here. Old guys like me, we got to walk a lot. Keep ourselves healthy. Oh, I gotta keep walking. Don't stop. Don't get comfortable. I just stop walking. That's the worst thing you can do. You want to fight age? Keep yourself in good shape. You gotta keep moving. That's my motto. Keep moving. My phone was taken off on me again there. Try to straighten it up. There we go. There's a nice piece of land right there for putting something on. Maybe, maybe it's planned. Can't imagine they're just going to leave it. Let it go to waste. You could put a building on it. Land is valuable here. As it is in every city. Every city land is valuable. It's so valuable that you can buy a land with a house on it and tear the house down and still make lots of money. So it's uh, quite valuable. Now you got a choice of four buses right here. The four. The 90, the 7, and the 8. I know the 7 and the 8 both will take you to Scotia Square. I don't know about the 4 and the 90. I'm not sure. Cedar Street. I used to live on a Cedar Street once. Not this one, but a different Cedar Street. Ah, won't be long. We'll get through winter and I'll be walking down here and the sun will be warm. I'll be wearing my spring jacket and commenting on the leaves popping on the trees and the green grass starting. <laughs> it won't be long. Yeah, we'll be there. I wonder if the park is going to be open today. You never know, right? It might be. Which means I, I should go, I should cut across here and then, and then angle over toward the 
Hold my guidance just in case it's open. If it wasn't open yesterday or the day before because of the snowstorm and just clearing of the snow. But I would think it's in good shape today. There's no reason it wouldn't be open. So we can walk through there on the way down back downtown. Sound like a good idea? Okay. Man, my good friend Mike, there's Jubilee Road. Getting handy to your old place. We used to live. Oh look, we got a walk sign. Let's get across. Oh, we can go while the good. Get while the getting good, as they say. Well, we got the plow in front of us down there on the sidewalk. Some kind of a machine, I think it's a plow. Just went by here, maybe it's salt, maybe it's putting salt down. I'm not sure. But at least it's in front of us and not coming towards us. There, the Veterans Hospital. Just passing here. And we get over to the next. Whoop, there goes my phone again. The cold weather. Maybe one day I'll get something different and I won't have to use my phone anymore. Like a GoPro or something like that. When I can spare the money. Yeah, it won't be it won't be this year. Maybe maybe if I'm lucky, maybe next year, maybe one more year. And I'll get a GoPro or something. Well, this could be a good video. I got 22 minutes in so far. By the time we get downtown, I should be close to an hour. Come on, phone. Don't do that. There. I'll let this guy go in. He's playing. I'm not waiting for him. I'm just waiting for the bus. Bus people, the transportation people. East Link, you're on your own, you have to wait. It's amazing somehow I kept my feet dry through all this. <coughs> it's worth it because. Boots are heavier than sneakers, so it's, yeah, if you're walking long distances, boots is not the answer, but sometimes it's what you have to wear. Like the last two days in the snow, I wore my boots. Today, I've freed up my feet and wear my sneakers. in a big hurry at all. Never be in a hurry. Don't hurry if you haven't got anything that you need to hurry over. That's the best way. Sometimes people are just hurrying for no reason. If I have to hurry, I'll hurry. But if I don't have to, I take my time. Well, we're down to Summer Street. That borders onto the, the corner of the, of the public gardens. Just gotta walk down a little bit that way, and then we'll be at the public gardens. And we'll try to walk through if it's open. Okay, I love I love going in there in the winter time when there's snow on the ground. It's so nice. Looks good, we'll walk across. It looks like the sidewalk's good up here. There we 
go. Down we go, and we'll come right out to the public gardens. Now well, that's a strange looking uh, plow, <laughs> to say the least. <laughs> Okay, now, straighten my phone up one more time. There you go. I don't know how many steps I have on today, but I think I'll have a pretty good walk in the time I get done. Almost there. We will see if it's open. Don't see anybody walking in there. Not looking good, but we'll see. Maybe. No, this gate's not open. No, not looking. Not looking good right now. I was hoping it would be open so we could walk through there, but don't look that way. No, I got the padlock on it. Looks like we got the walkways uh, shoveled, but I don't know. That's the third day in a row now it's been closed. What a nice day to walk through the park. We'll just cheat a little bit. We'll just look over the fence. That's the best I can do, folks. I can't get in. Oh. I hear a lot of sirens over something. Don't know what it is, but right. all the kids coming from something. Noon hour, maybe. Yeah, that's probably what it is. Probably noon hour. We take different times depending on the class they're in. Soon be down to Spring Garden. I wanted to walk through the park so bad. I think it's just beautiful in there when they got the walkways like this, and then the snows on the sides and the trees with no leaves on them. Like it, it's beautiful. Who wouldn't like to walk through that? You no, know, they need to let us in. They really do need to open that up when there's snow in there so people can walk and enjoy the beauty. The beauty of nature. There's beauty in all kinds of nature. There's, there's beauty in trees with no leaves and crooked branches and stuff. Yes, it's beautiful. Don't deny us. <laughs> we want to use it. We want to see it. We want to walk through it. Photograph it, video it. And what do you do? You lock the gates up and won't let us in. Oh. Complain to the mayor. 
Of course, you know I'm joking, right? Yeah. What would life be if they couldn't joke a little bit? Some people don't like joking, but I like it. I admit it makes the day brighter. But there are people who don't like it. They don't like people to make little jokes about stuff. But I think it makes your day go much better to joke a little bit. As long as your joke is not malicious or harmful to anybody. Sure, why not, right? There we go, now we're making our way back into civilization again. Once more into civilization. Downtown Halifax. A beautiful place to be in the wintertime. Because look how mild it is and warm here. There are lots of places that you can't walk around in the wintertime because it's too cold. It's not cold. It's warm. It's nice. It's warm for winter. Like it's one degree. Well, one degree above zero. And that's, I don't call that cold for this time of year. I call that warm for winter. For big winter. We're just barely past the middle of winter. We have six weeks left, so they say. But who knows? Might only be four weeks left. Well, four weeks from now, we'll be in March. So who knows if it's six weeks or could be eight weeks. <laughs> no, don't say that. Maybe they had a change of heart and opened up one of these gates down here. But I didn't see anybody walking in there, so I can only assume that there's no gates open. They don't look like it. Nah, they're all closed. They're all closed, chained around them, locked up tight. Limited winter maintenance on pathways. Use it on risk. Well, I would if it could get in. But anyways, it is what it is. They got us locked out. This is a crime, I tell you. <laughs> All right. It's hard to be serious. I'm not a serious person. So only once in a while I talk about something that strikes a serious chord with me. But most of the time it's I like to joke and kid around. I hope you enjoy that kind of thing. I hope you are a type of person that likes to joke and kid around. That's the kind of people I like. I like people that like to joke and have fun and talk nonsense sometimes. Yeah. Life doesn't have to be serious all the time. Oh, I always notice Ontario plates whenever I see them. Since we lived up there for a long time. Yeah, I, I never pass a car if I got in Ontario without seeing it. It just automatically, I, my eyes focus on it. Well, we're almost down to where the businesses are on Spring Garden. There's the Lord Nelson right there. The, that big hotel in the background. An iconic fixture in downtown Halifax. Been there quite a while. One of the larger hotels. Victoria Park right over there. But I think we'll just stay uh, focused on how's our time here 35 minutes we'll just stay focused on the streets today guess, and make our way uptown oh we gotta walk good we'll keep walking
back in the business section. Spring Garden Road, no less. This is a really nice street now, especially in the summer, because they've widened the sidewalks all out. There's only one lane going each way. <laughs> Pigeons! doing something on me again. There we go, straighten back out. Straighten her back out again. Super Bowl, that's real, that's past. That's past, they gotta change their sign. Park Lane, I'm gonna swing in here. Whoops, so I swing in here and go to the washroom. Then I'll continue this when I come back out. Okay, take it a break. Okay, I'm back. As we make our way on down Spring Garden Road. Sorry about that little jerky motion there. Yeah, I was putting on my gloves. Yeah. All right, we'll make our way on down and uh, Looks really busy today. I guess people are happy that it's warm out. It stops snowing and it's warm out. And people are happy and the street is full of people. Nothing coming, I'm gonna go. Okay. Well, we'll just keep on going down. Getting really snow pictures in, huh? How you doing? Yeah, I'm doing a I'm doing a snow video oh, today. Good for you, good for you. Yep. Yeah. Hey, oh yeah? Do you do you watch YouTube? I do actually, yeah. Yeah. I, I like snows, I like different animals. If you ever want to see any of my videos, I go by Halifax Walker. Okay, cool, yeah? Yeah, go check it out. Okay, awesome. Maybe I'll get some good action. All right. I've, I've been doing it for about three years now, so i got a lot of videos on there. Okay, sounds yeah. good. I'm going to get into it. All right, take care. All right, maybe we win a, win a new guy. Gonna, maybe I'll be a subscriber. Who knows? Maybe we'll get a new subscriber on here. No Tim Wood today on Spring Garden. I'm going right on past Spring Garden Road. No Tim Hortons today. I've had enough coffee for one day, I think. And we'll just keep on going. Make our way uptown. I have to get back to Scotia Square. I might take a roundabout to walk, who knows? Possibly. That building's coming right along. That's all part of the thing. Yeah. Well, let's get across. I don't like my, my phone in the cold weather. It just won't stop moving around on me. It won't. It's still not right. Okay, I'll see if I can get this thing to straighten up. There we go. Okay.
Oh, this is annoying. And all it is is the cold. It's just don't perform good in the cold. You may do it, but it is. video button so it is what it is. Don't you love these nice wide sidewalks? Spring Garden Mall, there's two lanes now and we got all kinds of sidewalks for walking. That's great. I love it. What this phone? I don't know this, so I can't even bring it around on the on the handle anymore. There we go. And hopefully it'll stay there for more than uh, one minute. here a bit. Certain areas of the city just seem to have more wind than others. Well, let's cut through the, cut through the path here. There we go. To this nice bare walkway and little breeze of the flags, not too much. Well, I've had a great day making videos today. This is great. I got one for tomorrow and I got one for Friday now. But I'm all set for the week and sometime this week I'll make my Monday one. It's always nice to be ahead a little bit in case, in case something comes up like a heavy downpour or something for like three days. So just in case things like this happen, the weather is uncooperative. If I stay ahead one or two, then I can cover it when we get that kind of weather and it's impossible to be out. That's my, that's my way of thinking about it. Just, uh, plan ahead a little bit and that way we don't run into difficulties I'm trying to get our videos out have to miss one because of the weather stay ahead one or two but the bare ground sticking though to get them maybe the snow won't stick around too long kind of looks like it's melting pretty fast because we are plus one, and there's a little bit of, uh, you see a flurry now in them, but there's also a little bit of water mixed in with that flurry. Okay, let's go down, make it right here at Blower Street, at Pizza Corner, and go down the hill. Right there. There. It's kind of stopped just for the moment. We're trying to find a route where not so much wind. If we can. Some 
of these streets are like wind tunnels. I passed this picture not long ago. First time I noticed it was a day or two ago. And uh, looks like they put new stuff on the outside. Oh, here we go again. There we go. Anyway, I couldn't tell you the question because by the time I got my phone straightened out, it's past it. So. Another day. Well, we're down to Barrington. Well, what do you want to do now? I walk Barrington quite often. Let's, let's go down the hill. I can walk Granville Street. I could have ran across there, but let's go over here so I can take the crosswalk. My phone is just not cooperating here. There we go. I'm having a rough time with it today because of the weather today. It doesn't want to be where it's supposed to be. Right now it's not in the main road. There we go. Okay. We're back. I show you a building that they what here we go again. Lucky I got a button to correct that. Okay, I'll turn slowly. Show you a building right here that I've been working on. Well, here we go again. This thing just doesn't want to stay put. Alright, that building right there looks pretty good, don't it? It used to be old and, and uh, kind of run down. They put all new windows in it, gave it a fresh paint job, and it's probably going to be a really nice uh, apartment building when they're all done. Although it could be offices, but I doubt it. Offices aren't in big demand anymore. Apartments are what's in demand now. Nobody, there's all kinds of empty offices around. You can't rent them. Ever since COVID, when they let people work from home, that ruined them. They didn't want to come back. And a lot of the companies didn't want to bring them back because now they don't have to pay to heat the, the, their work areas and all this kind of stuff. So, yeah. So, anyway, a lot of empty office buildings now, empty office space within some buildings because of COVID. Up until that point, nobody even thought of moving out of an office and working home. Now, yeah, it never even crossed their minds till COVID. Then they shut down and now they don't want to come back. Yeah. Looks like, unless I'm wrong, a construction job right there. It looks like, I'm gonna take a closer look going across the road where I can see. It looks like just the beginnings of a, of a construction job. Right there. I don't even know what was here before. Something, there's a remnants of what was ever was here before. Right there. Yeah, I have no idea what was here before. But it looks to me like they're building something new here. We'll take a little look through the fence and see. Yeah, they got the sign up there for safety vests and all that stuff and boots and yeah, I would say it's gonna get you join right onto that building. Uh, maybe come over to here, I don't know. Try to say the fence goes up to here. Oh, here we go. This right here is what's going in. Wow. See what it says here. <laughs> Upper yard, retaining wall. One. Well, apparently there's going to be a hotel right here. Hotel. Let's see. Let's see. I 
rocks in the cars ahead. And that looks like two or three buildings. Let's have a look and see if make sure that's not the same one that's over there in the back. I don't think it is, it don't look like it. No, it don't look like it at all. Anyway, what it looks like is uh, two or it's all oh, there. I go, there goes my phone again. It won't stay put. Excuse me for all that wondering, but that looks like what they're building here. Yeah. Wow, I like it. I like it. Some of it's down the hill a little bit and some of it's up there. Anyway, there you are. New, new project right here. Right here at 1568 Hollis. All right. I love it. Love it when I see these new things going up. I get so excited when I see new buildings going up. Yeah, we got a lot of land right up there, then it cuts down over the hill, and there's more down there. And this goes all the way up to the fence. We got lots of room here to build. And then you got that spot down below. I want to see. It looks like it's going to be two levels. Okay, let me straighten up my phone again for the 500th time. Yeah. If it was a warm day, it wouldn't be doing that. It's doing that because it's cold. Cold enough to affect it. All right. We'll go down Sackville Street and I'll get a look at the, the lay of the land down there. And see that. It looks like it's going to be two levels all joined in together. And that huge construction project. Oh, I love it. I love it. See stuff getting built in our city. To make our city look more like a, a big city. Got to have, gotta have tall buildings to make your city look great. Now, there's a parking lot there, but that might be re, uh, redestined for something else. It may not be a parking lot for long. All right, there we go. Okay, we're coming down to Hollis Street. See, if they use all this, I'm having a hard job pointing my phone because it just doesn't want to follow me. It's, uh, I'm having a hard time with that, but ignore it. Alright, we'll look up over the fence and there's all of our empty space down there. Looks like that last piece of cement's probably gonna get torn down to that. And then I'll start digging and there we are. Another big project. Corner of Sackville and Hall Street. Right the street on the other. It's going to be a Where I'm standing, Sackville and Hall This has been a great day today and had a lot of fun out making these videos and I hope you're enjoying them. You must be or you wouldn't be watching them, right? And of course. And I must be enjoying, enjoying making them or I wouldn't be out here. But I love doing it. Love it. So here we are. Bed Bedford Row, I don't know if I want to walk that way. But. No, well we could a little bit. Let's go that way. Sure, why not? 
after all this is a, a snow walking video so uh, we could just kick this way because there's more snow on the street a little bit of snow falling too Bedford Row is just a small street one way parking both sides and driving down the middle and Looks like it's coming out of the north. That's probably why we're getting snow again. Caution, falling snow. I thought all snow was falling snow. There we go again, trying to be funny. <laughs> oh, there's no hope, no hope. Nope, no hope for me. I'm just uh, born to be a funny guy. As much fun as winter is, I think the summer is going to be more fun, though. <laughs> but we've been really lucky. I've been able to get out and make videos all winter. Then maybe even once or twice on the day I wanted to go. It was too windy, but it didn't really slow me down too much. I've been able to get out and make enough videos, and that's great. Now, Benefit Row, one more street is lower water. Do you want to go down there? All right. We'll go down to lower water. Walk our way up and then we'll make our way back up towards uh, Scotia Square where I'm going to be hanging out until bus time to take the bus home. British feel to it. It feels like you're in England. The old Mitchell house. 1820. Well preserved. Alright. We'll take lower water. they don't have wind because I look ridiculous chasing my umbrella down the street which I have done before causing people to laugh <laughs> I would laugh too if I saw somebody chasing their umbrella down the street just something funny about that Off. Okay. Well, I'll be signing off before too long now. Make it up the hill and that'll be it. Well, I can sign off down here. Anytime from where I am. All right. What do you think about this corner right here? We can sign off. We can sign off right here, couldn't we? All right. Sure. Why not? Right here on the corner of Lower Water and uh, George. 
George tree than lower water. If you go any further, it's upper water. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to push that like and subscribe buttons. And um, if you're already a subscriber, thanks for subscribing to this channel. I hope you're enjoying these videos. And with that, I hope you're having a really nice day. Take care, be safe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye for now.